Hey guys, how are you doing today? It's Agnes here, your laptop lifestyle architect and online business manager, and I am the host of the VAs with Initiatives group. So I've seen this online that people are having loads of trouble when they are starting out or doing something new to actually deal with the pricing and uh, and package based, time based or something like that. There are a couple of, uh, you know, rule of thumbs, I think, uh, after working for a VA company and having my own clients for five, six years now or something like that. Um, I definitely would recommend to do packaging price. Why? Because I don't believe that you're supposed to be punished if you are good in something. And the client is not paying for your time or shouldn't pay for your time. They should pay for uh, the result what they get. So that's why I generally say that packaging price and result oriented price is good. And Yes, you can have a discussion with the client. Obviously, you know, it's a, it's a collaboration. It's a, it's a co-working. Uh, but uh, I would definitely go with the, with the package price and result oriented price if it comes to, if it comes to a new client. I think it's just more of a setting the expectations type of thing, right? So it's, it's more like, uh, look, I am professional. I know what I'm doing. This is the result. This is the end result. This is the task, what you need to get done. And this is my price for that. If they are not ready to pay the price, um, you can negotiate, you can add or remove stuff from the from the results or from the process or whatever you are offering. Obviously, there are tons of different uh, things. So I guess going through that, it's a it's a whole workshop in itself. Let me know if you if you are interested uh, to go through all the questions, but uh, I would definitely say that uh, it's not a negotiation. It's you know if when you when you when you know what you are selling, then you know how to price it. Then the client knows what he gets, and uh, then they know the price. And if it's a good investment or a bad investment for them, that's it. Um, I, I'm just thinking different different options, right? It's like yes, you can um, you can you can negotiate in how you track your time, or I usually track my time for myself to see if that's uh, you know if that's reasonable what I charge or not. But after a while, you just know stuff, right? Uh, but at the beginning, I would I would I would definitely go with the, with the charging and maybe give the client two options. Uh, but do not ask them or usually a client who just needs the result doesn't really care how how long it takes. You are the professional, you're delivering the result and that's all what matters. OK, guys, I hope it helps. Let me know if you have any questions in the comment, if you're watching the replay to make sure that uh, the video will be picked up and more and more people can see that. OK, guys, thank you very much. Have an amazing day. If you haven't done yet, join. In the, the VAs with initiatives group where I share more tips and uh, free webinars and uh, all uh, juicy good kind of things to make sure that you have a scalable online VA business. Okay, thank you very much, guys. Have an amazing day. Bye.